Bom dia, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in this beautiful world or whenever you're watching this video, welcome to the Bitcoin Family YouTube channel. For the newcomers guys, my name is Didi Taihutu and yes, you might recognize me and my family from yesterday's article in the Decrypt news platform. Do check this news platform because I really love the news they are publishing. I've been using their news articles for many months already in my videos. They create really cool articles and yesterday we as a family were part of one of their articles thumbs up for decrypt guys and talking about articles yes we are doing everything we can to get as much as possible articles published because we want to create awareness the last two weeks we were published in Spanish articles we were published in Portuguese language in French language in German language in English English language and of course also in the Dutch language so yes we as a family are really supporting Bitcoin to the fullest. We try to reach as much as possible people all over the world in all different languages because we want to get the message out there about Bitcoin and about the true fundamentals of Bitcoin and just educate people that it's just not only a financial tool to trade and to make profits, but that Bitcoin is also something that is already changing the world. At the moment guys, I'm walking back to the wrapping company. It's a 30 minute walk, but I'm walking there to check up on the car. And maybe I can even show you a preview in today's video. It was white. Let's see how it looks now. Not now, but like in 30 minutes when I arrive at the wrapping company. But let's stop talking about life and all that shit. Let's stop. Let's start to talk about crypto because that is probably what you want to hear. September guys was not that beautiful month and it's the last day of September tomorrow we will have October let's see how we close today's candle today's monthly candle but I will get to that in a minute first September was awful because we can see that even in the DeFi industry guys most projects were facing huge losses I think 93% of the top 250 coins lost a lot of value in September shitty month September I hate September <laughs> Let's get into October fast now. <laughs> For example, BZX lost 85% of their value. Curve lost like 78% of their value. Ren lost like 57% of their value. And even Aave, you know, the land platform, the Aave coin even lost 29% of their value in September. So September is a month we quickly need to forget. Let's move on to October. But first, let's close this monthly candle of September above 10,750 today. And that would be a very positive indicator for the upcoming October month. But the upcoming October month has been a very good month for crypto in the last couple of years. So probably October will be a beautiful month again this year as well. And yes, of course, because I forgot to tell you yesterday, you need to zoom out in crypto. You need to zoom in that life. These months like September are just part of the game. Every bull run comes with its ups and downs. We go up and then we crash and we go up and we crash and we go up and we crash. And all these crashes are just part of the bull run. But in the end, we slowly go up in the next two years. But I will come back to that later. Another question, guys, that has been asked many times now is what song, Didi, are you playing below your videos? It's this really cool Indian sounding song. I love this song. This song is being created by a friend of mine with his three daughters. Yes, he has three daughters as well. We have a lot of things in common and I'm looking forward that after all this flu shit, we will meet in real life. I will play the song at the end of this video with some beautiful images from Portugal that I've captured in the last couple of weeks. September wasn't that bad for Bitcoin because Bitcoin did have a crash, a 20% crash to around uh, 10,000, 9,800 somewhere, but we recovered and we are still hovering about 10,500. So let's take a look at the Bitcoin charts at the moment. Let's start with this chart. Bam! On this chart, you can see that we are now slowly approaching the 100 simple moving average. That one is around 10,750. This 100 simple moving average should become the support. So that will be in line with closing this candle today above 10,750 US dollar. This monthly candle now I'm referring to, and this is the hourly chart. Every candle is an hour. After that, guys, there's a huge resistance around 10,850, 10,950. So even if we keep this support of 10,750, it will still be difficult to break the 10,900 level 
but nothing is impossible, as you know by now, in Bitcoin. If we are not able to flip this resistance into support, we could all the way fall down to the support levels of around 10,650 first, and then after 10,650, if you won't be able to hold that support, we will fall back to 10,550. Still positive if we keep moving above 10,500 US dollar. One comment was asking, Didi, how is your Prime XBT copy trading going? I will tell you, um, I started with $100. I am now down with $50, so I'm around $50. I think I started to invest exactly at the wrong moment with copy trading, because that was just before the crash of all these alts in the last two weeks. But now we are recovering again, because yesterday, the trader that I am copy trading made 20% profit and the day before 6% profit. So I already made back 25% of the losses I made in the last two weeks. I still believe this copy trading is really awesome. And now exactly in these dips is a beautiful moment to start to copy trade all these traders because they are starting to make profits again. Nobody can predict exactly what is happening in the markets. So also these traders can have some losses, but on average, a few of them have more than 300% profit if you calculate the whole time they have been trading on Prime XBT. So if you want to start this copy trading, do sign up using my referral link, because if you sign up using my referral link, you will receive a 50% deposit bonus exclusively when you sign up with my referral link, you will receive a 50% deposit bonus and you can start copy trading. So again, I am now 50% down, but I'm very confident that I will be up with 200% in the near future. But let's slowly zoom out guys and let's take a look at the four hour chart. <gasps> yeah, bam, indeed, <laughs> I got you there. But yes, let's do the bam together, bam. <laughs> On this four hour chart, guys, you can see two dotted lines coming down. One dotted line comes down from the 12K top and one dotted line is coming down from the 12.4K top. So both of these lines are very important. But let's first take a look at this dotted line that came down from the 12k top. The line that came down from the 12k top, as you can see, we broke this line to the upside and now we are retesting this line. If we can keep this line as a support, that's a very positive sign. I expect a bounce to the second dotted line that came all the way down from 12,400 till now. So that one is a little bit less steep downwards. So if we find support on this 12k downward line, we will bounce up to this 12.4k downward line. And guys, if we can't find support of this bottom dotted line, so we won't go to this um, dotted line above this one, then we could even fall down all the way back to this very thick line. This is the long-term trend line. This line is around 10,300 US dollar. It's all depending on how long that it will take that we will retest this line. It could also be that this line then already is at around 10,500 US dollar, which then again would be in line up with the chart that I just showed you before. So yes, this 10,500 region is a very important region of support. So in both of these scenarios, on the one hour chart, and now also on this four hour chart, 10.5K region is the biggest region of support. But let's not think about that. Let's think about the positive part. Well, closing this monthly candle above 10,000, 750 tonight so yes that would mean we would find support on this bottom dotted line and we will bounce back all the way to 11k 11.2k and later than even 11.4k that is the bitcoin move that i am expecting for the next couple of days weeks let's zoom a little bit more out let's take a look at the weekly chart at this one wait i need to give you the opportunity to say bam at the same time so let's take a look at the weekly chart BAM! Indeed, yes, that's how you do it. I always imagine that you guys at home are BAMming together with me. So that's why I'm so BAMming energetic every time, because I love to say the word BAM because it's some positive energy, you know? So I always imagine that when I say BAM, you and your head at home or very loudly yell together with me, BAM! <laughs> you know? Probably most of you will do it in your head, like silently so that your kids and the wife are not in shock and <laughs> not freaking out. Um, tell them to zoom out, but <laughs> I just imagine you sitting there behind your computer with your headphones listening to this video or <laughs> with your iPhone and then BAM! You know, you're the whole family in shock. Ah, wish it was like that. <laughs> On this weekly chart, guys, we can see the weekly close. The, the weekly close of last week was a very positive close. It was a close above 9,900 US dollar. This week, I think we are going to close even higher. So on the weekly chart, I don't understand why all of these bear people are bearish at the moment. 
why are you all expecting these huge drops? I can only see an uptrend on the weekly chart. I can see higher lows and even a few higher highs. And I think the next higher high will be made very soon. And to be very clear, like you can see, we already closed the weekly chart three weeks in a row above 9,900. Three weeks higher than 9,900 US dollar. So this is a very positive indicator. The trend is going up. I didn't see like a close in 9K or something where the trend is reversing. I can only see a big fly on my hand, probably a shit fly, but I can only see higher lows. So I don't see why people are so bearish because I didn't see one indicator on the weekly that we will have a reversal in trend. And guys, if we keep making these higher lows, I don't see a trend reversal. I, I see that we will make a new higher low around 11K in the upcoming weeks. And then when this new higher low will be made, then again, I can see a move upwards to 12K. Till we see a lower low on this weekly chart, I can't turn bearish. I can only stay bullish because the trend is still up. Yes, turning left here. So we are almost back at the car. Very exciting. I'm so excited to see how how far they already evolved with all the wrapping. I think it will take another five to 10 minutes till I'm there. Again, this fly on my lip. Do I smell like shit? Or I am talking too much about shit coins and that's why the flies come to me now. I don't know. <laughs> Probably it's the last one. I'm talking too much about shit coins and that's why the flies are going on my face and everything. <coughs> Again, but so I want to show you one more chart, really cool chart. Of course, we are zooming out a little bit more. We are going to talk about the monthly chart. And this monthly chart is going to show you the exact number we will reach in Bitcoin when, we, when history is going to repeat. So let's take a look at this monthly chart. BAM! That's the BAM we want to hear on the monthly chart. A very loud one. Wake your family up. Man, they are going to call me Didi Bam Bam in the future, I think. Bam bam diddy. Bam 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 Is that a song? Hey buddy, bam 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 I don't know the song. If you know the song, uh, comment below. I'm really better at charts than I am at singing, so let's talk about charts. This monthly chart. Bam! Indeed, that monthly chart. Wow. Is history going to repeat? Let's first take a look at the 2012 to the 2014 bull run. It took 12 months from the lowest point till the halving, and then it took another 12 months from the halving to the top of that bull run. So in total, from the lowest point till the top of the bull run was exactly two years. This is a monthly chart, guys. So every candle is a month. So 24 candles is two years. Then if we take a look at the bull run from 2015 to 2017, from the lowest point till the halving took about 18 months. And then from the halving, to the all-time high you all refer to as the bull run, you know, the 20K, took another 17 months. So the 2017 bull run almost took 35 months. That's like almost three years. That's a year longer than the bull run before that one. I think it was in total around 1070 days or something, the previous bull run. So now let's take a look at the current bull run. Yes, I'm referring to the current bull run because I believe we already are in the bull run. It took about 17 candles, 17 of these bars, from the lowest point till the halving in May. If we would repeat history, it would take another 17 or 18 candles till this new all-time high. And this new all-time high would then be between 266 and 330,000 US dollar per Bitcoin if history would repeat. And like you can see on the chart, history is a little bit repeating every time. Because on the chart, you can also see these green triangles. If you look at the first green triangle, you can see there was a 650% profit from the lowest point till the halving. That's where the triangle ends. And then the previous bull run, so the last one in 2017, you can see this exact same triangle. But this triangle showed us from the lowest point till the halving, a return on investment of 380%. And if we take a look at this current triangle, from the lowest point till the halving, we again made a 339% profit. So that's a little bit less than the previous bull run. Previous bull run we saw a 380%, this time we saw a 340%. So if we would copy the previous bull run run, <laughs> the previous bull run run after the halving, then we would see a price now of around 266,000 US dollar up till 330,000 US dollar if history would repeat. 
if we would repeat the same amount of bars till the next autumn high if we would make the same profit from the halving till the autumn high as we made in the previous bull runs and yes the profit was almost the same from the lowest point till the halving so why would this profit now from the halving to the next all-time high be different than in these previous bull runs i love this chart i think this chart is making very clear what we can expect from bitcoin in the next 17 candles from now but i think these numbers that we see on the charts they are not impossible i've been here in this industry now since 2013 nothing is impossible in bitcoin guys everything can happen yes we can even crash to zero is possible but we can also reach new all-time highs above 100k above 200k maybe even above 300k everything is possible in this crazy industry as you could have seen in these last small bull runs in this DeFi industry we saw 900% runs we saw 3000% runs we saw immense runs just these last six months so you don't think that Bitcoin can repeat history that Bitcoin can do the same you don't think that all these people that made these massive profits now in this DeFi industry that took these runs of two three four five thousand percent of profit that invested in yarn finance and took all these profits you don't think they are now going to invest and hedge back into Bitcoin of course they are they are going to buy Bitcoin because Bitcoin is the oldest one is the most stable one if it comes to consecutive grow in the last 11 years so yes these people are also going to exchange their short-term profits in these alts the trade profits into Bitcoin because they also believe that this Bitcoin bull run is around the corner that were all the charts for today guys I am almost there at the garage so yes give me a minute to walk there and I will film the car for you guys so you can see the first images of this new really cool Bitcoin Prime Machina that's going to drive around a few countries the next three months in a crazy cool tour where I'm going to make crazy cool videos and entertainment for you guys and for everybody else there that still needs to find our channel so please give this video already a thumbs up share it already with your friends and family subscribe to our channel and please leave a comment and hit the notification bell so you are notified in every new video thanks for watching already stay tuned because i'm going to show you now this bitcoin prime machine hey, yo, yo.